too many people are focused in the wrong areas in life. If you still find fulfillment and happiness from going to parties, hosting parties, drinking, going out with your friends to play this game or whatever, playing video games, watching TV, if that is still fulfillment and fun for you, you're simply not locked in in life. You do not know or understand what the best route is for you to take and you're not in the right place where you want to be in life. Because if you know exactly what you have to do right now and for the next few weeks and for the next few months to get to your goals, let's say you have the dream of hitting $20,000 a month, but that doesn't happen from you doing whatever you're trying to do right now in life. You have to play the game of life. Like if you're escaping your reality of life and you hate what you're supposed to be doing on the day-to-day -day basis, you don't find any reasoning or purpose from it because you're just going to school and then eating food and then doing your homeworks and then taking the tests and then repeating, then you're clearly in the wrong area where you should be. And when you're finding accomplishment, fulfillment, joy from external factors, like the things I said previously, you have to fix your route instead of sorting to all those other aspects to make you happy and fulfilled. I knew at a very, very young age, when I was still 12, 13 years old, that I didn't want to go the traditional route. School was never for me, and I understood that this didn't make sense at all. Why would I need to learn and figure out X and Y equals MX plus B? Why do I need to do A squared plus B squared and C squared? How is that gonna make me money? How is that gonna put $20,000 into my bank account every single month figuring out what X is? Why do I need to know how to spell photosynthesis and iconic but the, how is that going to make me money? When things start to make sense and you know exactly what you have to do, I guarantee you as a fact that going to the party, playing video games, hanging out with your friends all the time, doing pointless shit will be not fulfilling. And building an empire, creating, and putting yourself out there is really what's going to make your life fulfilled. All these plaques that you see behind my desk was years of hard work, sweat, tears, and knowing that this was the path I was going to take no matter what. And the thing I find most interesting about everyone, let's imagine Fortnite as a scenario. What you should be doing to find fulfillment and level up your ability as a character is to play the game often and as often as possible so you become the best and you level up like that. But too many of you guys are hating the game and playing Fortnite actually, but you guys would rather look at those dresses, maybe play in training grounds, maybe 1v1 in some no death zone. And you're not actually finding fulfillment in the actual physical game. Does that make sense? The same thing goes for life. You have to actually find fulfillment and purpose in the game that you're playing. If your dream is to become a lawyer or a doctor, then you should find fulfillment from doing your homework, doing your assignments. But clearly, if you're not, then you're not built for that life. Figure out what you want to do first. Figure out what your end result is. And then after that, make you plan to build towards that rather than finding external fulfillment from partying, drinking, all that bullshit. Does that make sense? And I'll say this right now. It's not even that difficult to win or become successful. This didn't come from, you know, being the top 1% alpha male and quitting all the bad habits that I had to do. You will naturally quit those bad habits that you currently have, but just finding the right habits and replacing it with the things that you know will do you good and actually does do you good. You can't just completely take out something and go cold turkey on it. For example, if you vape every single day for years, you can't just quit that automatically and just boom, you, sh you never hit it again, nothing, no questions asked. That's just simply not gonna happen. But if you replace it with something else that you know is better for you and you swap the two, that will slowly help you quit and over time, you're gonna win. By all means, have fun in your life. Go hang out with your friends, I'm not telling you to not do that. But if you only resort for those to find fulfillment and happiness in your life, you are clearly never gonna live the life that you dreamed of and find fulfillment in your long-term goals. Have those on the side to help you whenever you feel a little bit burnt out or whatever, but replace those hours that you put in wasting to those from those external factors over to building and creating your own little legacy and empire. And obviously, as I say to everyone, if you are ready to build your empire on YouTube and to be able to make a full-time income off of posting faceless automated YouTube videos that you don't have to do the work yourself, but you manage, I help 9to5ers replace their 9to5 income with the help of this. And so I want you to click on the link below this video in the description. Watch my video training, which shows you exactly how you can get started as a beginner, A to Z. And after that, you can apply below to work with me one-on-one -on -one, and I'll work with you no matter what, no matter how long it takes until you reach at least $5,000 a month no questions asked. I'll see you on the other side of YouTube.